Thanks, Rich. Yes, we have the manager down with us. Well, are you happy with the point you've earned here at Carrow Road this evening? Well, under the circumstances, it's definitely a good point uh, on the road. We have to deal with uh, several injuries. Also, the, the story of the game, also with the injury of Ilya Gruff was not the easiest one. Um, and if you're one nil down here in a um, difficult, difficult atmosphere, difficult ground, they are unbeaten at home, it's not easy to come back because they play then with full confidence and with full euphorism. And, and even if they put the ball on the stand, the whole stadium is, uh, is buzzing. It's, it's important to, to keep the nerves. That's what we did. And... Uh, I think even the first half we were a bit untidy in order to use our good winnings of the ball. We had good situations, sits the post, but it, I think three or four times a three against two situation could have been a bit more tidy on the ball. Um, this is what I was asking for at half time to, to not lose the nerves, to make sure that we don't concede a counter and we go for it. The Lads did brilliantly, scored a fully deserved, um, well taken goal, 1 uh, 1 equalizer. Yes, and then we had our situation with Brendan Aronson, a good chance, with, uh, with Jaden Bogle, a really good, really good chance. I think it's also a penalty on, on Willy Gnonto. Um, I think we're really, really close to win, claim all three points, but Norwich is a really good side, and each of the counter attack with players like Sargent, like Sainz, you have to be switched on, and for that, um, I think we're a bit closer to, 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 um, to win the three points, but over, overall, I think both teams can also live with one point, and for us, under these circumstances, it's definitely a good point. Towards the end, with a few tired legs out there, it was that kind of game, wasn't it? Yes, it's always difficult. Yeah, Largi scored a fantastic goal. I wanted to keep him on the pitch as long as possible, but also we have to keep in mind three games within six uh, six uh, days. Actually, I just planned him to leave him on the pitch just for 60 minutes, but then he scored, and I wanted to use his momentum a little bit. Um, yes, we were forced to to be there. Was an early substitution also already in the in the first half and. Um, but I have to say I have to praise the players who came in. So for our not easy, the first game in the starting lineup, I think it was excellent today. Joe Roswell, first game in the starting lineup since ages, was also important that he was straight away um, there. Also for Patrick after a long-term injury, his first minutes. Um, overall, compliments uh, to, to the lads. Also Geoffrey Gellard involved in the last 10 minutes. It could have gone in, in both directions. Last, last minutes was a pretty open game. Um, but overall, I would say I think we were a bit closer to win this game. But um, yes, sometimes you have to live uh, with a point, especially on this, uh, when it's such a difficult away place and uh, we all uh, can live with this point. That's definitely for sure. I think the response to the boys was very good after going a goal down. But at times I was watching a basketball game. There's no real control there. Yes, we played today with a completely different center of the game. So Joe and, and Ao, I think Ao was excellent against the ball, but our positioning first game was, was not great. So sometimes we were overloading with both the right side and left side instead of staying in the center so that we can switch the play a bit more, that we have more control over the counter-attacks. But this happens once you have to change your whole center of the uh, of the game. So no criticism uh, for that. They will also learn out of this game and will analyze this. I got the same feeling. We were a bit... Yeah, too much in t in t caught in transition moments in the uh, in the uh, in the second half, but it's also out of good desire. We wanted to win this mm -hmm. game. I think we were a bit overdoing this. A bit more calmness would have been better. But nevertheless, uh, credit uh, to the effort, credit uh, to the workload, and that we kept the nerves. Um, good point for us. Given the swift turnaround for the Sunderland game now, what's the news with Ilya Gruev? Do you know any more yet? Knee injury, I uh, was not able for him to turn him anymore, so it doesn't look that great, but we have to wait for the further further assessment. Yes, I hope it's not too bad, because especially in this uh, in this positions, we have already a few players uh, players out. Tricky times at the moment, we have to stick together and show unity, this is what the lads showed today, the lads we needed today in this position stepped up, was uh, was quite important, and, and this is what we'll probably also have to do for the... Yeah, third game was in six days before the international break and then I hope in pretty soon the uh, situation will, will look a bit brighter but uh, with India we have to wait a bit.